Hey everybody, Mark Shepard here, and I uh, just came back from cross-country skiing. I've been taking a wonderful Sunday off and uh, just kind of checking in with the charts, looking, and I see what I am considering to be a buy signal in Litecoin, and it's very similar to what I was seeing in Dash, and let me compare that with Dash. See, we have the sideways trading range, and the, the trend is up, and then boom, it lifts okay now I'm not buying dash right now because I get dash every day from my Genesis mining contract mining Bitcoin right but I sold all my Litecoin I think a week or so ago and I'm thinking that it is time I'm gonna take some of my profits from Neo and grab some Litecoin so that's what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna do it on camera um, my Neo has popped into my number one position here uh, and let's see what it's worth at the moment it's worth four thousand seven hundred and fifty nine dollars when I left this morning it was not worth that much right so I'm not gonna take all my profits but I'm gonna take some of my Neo and I'm gonna buy me some electric coin um, so I'm gonna first sell my Neo into uh, Bitcoin because it's more uh, liquid and then I'm going to take that same amount and pop it into Litecoin. That's my plan. Let's see if I can do it. And uh, here we go. So we're going to sell a little Neo right here. It's up 50%. And the, I think the discipline is good to take some profits. When something is up, crazy up, take some profits. So... Uh, of course, I got to see how many what Neo is doing and get my head around it. So Neo against the U.S. dollar, boom, Neo's up, so it's seventy bucks, and so ten Neo would be seven hundred. So I might do ten Neo and buy seven hundred dollars worth of Bitcoin, and then buy seven hundred bucks worth of Litecoin. So that's, it'd be really nice if I could just go from NEO directly into Litecoin, but we're not there yet. Eventually, these exchanges will be like that. And you just go, oh, I just want to go into Litecoin, boom. Or I just want to go into NEO, boom, whatever you do. Okay, so let's figure this out. Do, 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 do. So if I sell 10 NEO and see what the price is. Nope, look at this. I'm about to make a mistake. And this again, people, I'm trying to show you. That would be buying NEO. I want to sell NEO. Here we go, right? Sometimes I get distracted. And this is what's difficult for my brain is this kind of stuff. So, and we want to ask to buy, bid to sell. So we're going to click bid. We're going to click immediate or cancel. And 10 NEO is going to, at the current Bitcoin price, is going to be about... Let's look at the price. I want to just double check this because my brain is good. About $730. Okay. So now we are going to just do the bid again because sometimes the price changes every second immediate or canceled. We're going to do 10 NEO. We're going to sell 10 NEO. And we're going to confirm it. Boom. NEO order filled. Says it's processed, and we're going to double check this, right? This is how I screwed up last week. We're going to go to the wallets. And my computer is much better now. And okay, now Neo is 60. It was 70. We sold 10 of them. Okay, now we're going to go back to the Bitcoin market, and we are going to buy. Litecoin, BTC to LTC, all right. Now, if you try to sell Litecoin and you don't have any, it won't let you, right? So we're gonna go right over here and let's see if I can just paste the 
same amount of Bitcoin and put the price in ask to buy. So that's 2.247 Litecoin. And we're going to hit immediate or cancel. And so that ought to do it. And we are I'm going to just do this again. The ask to buy. And we're going to buy Litecoin. Boom. That's not a lot because it's up pretty high. So if it does tank on me, I, I want to be feeling... I'm only going to buy what I feel comfortable if it like goes down 50%. If it goes down 50% and I put 700 in that was up from a 50%, it's house money, but I still want to be thrifty. I still want to be frugal. I still want to use excellent and intelligent money management skills. So that's what we're playing with here. Okay, so let's go back to the wallets. And we're going to have, whoops. I'll show all the ones that I have. So boom, boom, boom. There's Litecoin. Got two of them. So now I'm in a position if Litecoin wants to make a move. So this, I wanted to make a short video for you guys, and I wanted to, I wanted to catch it and do it and process it and upload it and get her done. So that's it on a Sunday. I don't normally do Sunday programs, but I just, I saw that my Neo is just cranking, and the discipline is to take some profits and find a place where you think. It can grow, and it's essentially you're hedging your bets with multiple different projects, but you want to make sure you have some place to take profits and some place that where you think it's either going to stay the same and hold your value or become worth more. That's the whole idea. So that's it, people. I'll see you in the next one. Start the music.